We finally made it. Now where might those fish be? This one's putting up a real fight. I'll get you next time. This fish is being stubborn. Good fishers always keep their cool. She's a big un. Good fishers always keep their cool. Feels like a big one. I'll let you go this time. Putting up a real fight. You go this time. Dang, this fish is being stubborn. You go this time. Hmm? This feels like a big one. Disappointing. Wow! 
This fish is seriously rare. Oh my gosh, that's a really rare species. One. Is that even a fish? It's rather enormous for one, is it not? Of course it is. It's an Orem arowana, a freshwater species that makes its home in these parts. It's quite the impressive specimen. Why, I don't believe we ever had anything so large for dinner back at the palace. That's because a fish like this is way too big to put on display at a formal dinner, let alone one for a sitting lord. You catch a giant fish, and all you can talk about is how you're going to eat it? What's wrong? You like eating too, don't you, Law? I can guarantee a fish this big is going to make for a good meal. Well, when you put it like that, I guess I am a little excited to dig into it and see how it tastes. Moments such as this are a good reminder of what I would have missed out on. I'm glad I decided to join you all in this journey. I may have once been a lord, but in truth, my insight into this world was rather limited. That is, despite the myriad opportunities lordship ostensibly affords. Wish every Renin was as self-aware as you. Maybe then things wouldn't be so bad. Indeed. When I say Menencio was beyond lucky to have you as its lord, I really mean it. I'd even say it was miraculous. Now, as for that fish, I'm thinking I'll make some steaks out of it tonight. Oh, that sounds good! I can't wait! Miraculous. That's hardly the word I would use to describe myself. A fish! You saw it too, right? Now where might those fish be? She's a big un. Get you next time. Wow, this fish is seriously rare. That thing lives on Dana? you caught another amazing fish yeah no kidding I had no idea there was anything like that even swimming around in the in the uh, uh Kisara huh oh hey Rinwell Alfin why the long face not happy with your hull are you not sure how you want to cook it if you don't mind it being grilled I'd be happy to do it for you no, it's nothing like that. Here, take a look at this. It's a golden catfish. Uh, a golden catfish? Is there some kind of problem with it or something? It's not like it's poisonous or anything, right? My brother Magal told me something about catfish once. He said, when you find a big one, it's an omen. And with a catfish this big, I'm just hoping it isn't a sign something bad's coming our way. Are catfish like that supposed to be bad omens? Not necessarily, but you know how these things go. Omens usually don't pop up to warn you of when good things are coming. 
Well, think of it like this. Omens just mean that change is coming. And in this case, it's change that all of us are going to bring. Totally. We're trying to overthrow the big bad Renans. If that's a bad omen for anyone, then we're going to make sure it's for them. Huh. I never thought of it like that. Then I guess you could say this fish is Migal's way of telling us that he's with us. That we can do this. We're going to build a future for Dana that's as bright as that fish. You bet we will. Looks like we made it here in one piece. Oh, y you know... Now, where might those fish be? <laughs> this one's putting up a real fight! Fishers always keep their cool. Wow, this fish is seriously rare. We sure hit the jackpot. That'll taste great. I wasn't sure if I'd actually reel it in, but somehow I did. That was intense! It looked like you were practically dueling with the fish! Yeah, I kept thinking your rod was going to snap in half the entire time I was watching. It's a whopper of an armored sturgeon. It wriggled so much I thought my arms would pop out of their sockets. The fish was all, bah! and your rod was all, creak! and the water was all, splash, 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 splash! But you held your own and reeled it in! It was crazy! You're like a heavyweight fishing champion! Heavyweight? Uh, law. Uh, no! I just mean you put your full weight behind the thing. <sighs> law, how about you put your full weight behind zipping your pie hole? Uh, I meant it as a compliment. Finally made it. There's something in the water. You saw it too, right? Now where might those fish be? Huh. 
Reel it in. Well, it's not bad, per se. You take your fishing pretty seriously. Now where might those fish be? Huh. Reel it in. us in a big one. That flapper was a true fighter. We've reached our destination. You're still not done fishing yet? Boring. You need patience to fish. Huh. All right. That wasn't much of a challenge. You sure know what you're doing. Huh. Hmm? This feels like a big one. Dagnabbit! It got away. <laughs> Dang, this fish is being stubborn. You've got to know when to quit. Away. Wow, this fish is seriously rare. We sure hit the jackpot. That'll taste great. Your rod was flashing like a sword! First this way, then that way, it was crazy! Indeed. That fish was quite fearsome in its own right. I applaud your tremendous skills in taming such an unwieldy beast. What he said! When you slammed your foot down and gave it that... It got me so pumped! 
Yes, it was quite the impressive war cry, I must say. <sighs> anyway, uh, what did you catch? Oh, oh, right. This is a silver marlin, the king of the seas, as they call it. I wanted to try to catch one at some point while we were out at sea. It almost looks like a sword blade with that intense sheen. It really does. With a head as sharp as that, I bet you could fight with it if you had to. If you could properly wield it, that is. Bear in mind, the marlin is known to be rather heavy for a fish. Well, if anyone could, it's probably Kisara, right? I mean, hell, she reeled in the damn thing. Yeah. <sighs> not that you aren't doing great already, Kisara. Your strength is often the only thing between our enemies and us. Yeah. Every time you lift up that shield, I'm glad you're on our side, Kisara. You're so stupidly strong, nothing can match your brute strength! Stupid? Brute? The only thing that could match it may be your sheer stupidity. What? Where'd that come from? I think it's safe to rest here now. Looks like we made it here in one piece. Is the Blazing Sword okay? A little water's not going to hurt it. There's something in the water. Everything looks fine with the lure. All right, let's do this. <laughs> All right, once more from the top. putting up a real fight. Tag nabbit, it got away. Hmm? This feels like a big one. Disappointing. I'll get you next time. This is quite the catch, if I do say so myself. That thing lives on Dana? What a gorgeous fish you caught. It almost looks a little like a gemstone. It's breathtaking. It's called a cobalt trout. They're actually tremendously rare. I never thought I'd catch one for myself. I wonder how it tastes. What? Look at how big it is. 
Its growth must have been pretty unusual. Maybe it absorbed some water astral energy or something. Mutated fish are known to be pretty cautious by nature. It's possible it turned out this way after years of avoiding human contact. We're still going to eat it though, aren't we? Come on, we... we don't have to eat it, right? I mean, I'm sure there are plenty of other fish we could catch later. Yeah, I guess. No way. You should always eat whenever you get the chance. You never know when the enemy will strike next. That's true. <sighs> That was quite the little adventure we went on. There's something in the water. 